Hey folks, it's me, JXP Tabo, the Lord of all YouTubers. Okay, that was a fucking blind ass lie. Um, I'm here today with my boy Sean, aka YKD Main, a fellow YouTuber with a measly five subscribers. It's so sad. It's so sad. For for ten cents a day, you could make the Y. For several views a day, you could make YKD Main subscriber count go up by at least tens a day. Now, YKD, please introduce yourself. Hello, folks. My name is YKD Main, aka Sean Puffer, aka OK Diablo. Uh, give us all of your socials. You know, hit us with the links. All right, my Snapchat is OK Diablo. Instagram is Toxic Rose 07. Oh three. And huh? Your thing is 03. Oh three. Toxic right, Rose 03. three. Bad. My apologies, it is Toxic Rose on the 3. And, and... That's pretty much it. Alright, so we're doing a Shadow of War backseat play, I think that's what it's called. Basically, it's like, I play it while Sean watches, you know, some basic shit, you know, normal shit. And so, he is here to give me his reaction of me playing it, because he's played a little bit of Shadow of War, but not all of it. Yeah. So he hasn't seen the full gory juiciness of this game. That is correct. Now let me show you um, the delicious feature that is the army. You can build your own army with all the orcs. You can recruit them or you can butcher them. Oh, wow. Uh, I think I have... Okay, here's one. This is Ur Lasu Unforgiving. He's a big boy. Oh, wow. That guy is big. Yeah, uh, let's see, where is... Oh, this guy, you will not believe the trouble I went through just to recruit this fucker. Okay. I had to shame him multiple times, which got rid of his level, and originally he was at 47, which would have been extremely powerful to have on my army, but I had to shame him to the point he was down to 39. And just look at this dude, and he's got nipple rings! Oh, wow. I know, but his one problem is that he had a little, he had a class trait, or no, he had a bonus that was a perk called Iron Will, which basically means I physically couldn't recruit him. Wow. I know, That's it was, impressive. it was such bullshit. Uh, let's see my most powerful. I think it is, um, Shock the Spike, or Skak the Spike. That guy looks like a bounty hunter. Yeah. Oh, and I just now realized, uh, wait a minute. Oh, okay, never mind. I was, I got confused there for a second. So, oh, excuse me. Sorry, folks. I got confused there for a second. Uh, I, for okay. I forgot what this guy was. Oh, this is my personal favorite. Zathra the Regal. Now that looks like a bomb. He literally has... Gold and fancy armor, and this dude's an orc, and orcs usually don't dress fancy. That is true. And plus, he is enraged by burning, he's enraged by cowards, he's enraged by his rival, and sadly, he has a blood brother, so the only problem is, this guy is, um, this guy's blood brother, so if this guy dies, this guy will try to kill me. Oh, wow. And they are both on my side, so that's why I was like, you know what, I don't want to kill him because Zathra is a really good soldier. I don't want to lose him. I would do probably the same thing that you chose. Though so yeah, today we are going to go find and execute a random captain and show Sean how exactly brutal I can be. Okay, let's get it. I am one brutal ass leader. You will see how absolutely brutal I can get. Just wait until you see. Just wait until you see my other brutalities. Okay, sounds interesting. All right, now as you can see, we are in a very gloomy city, okay. and I am playing a sexy beast named Italian, who is dead but not really. 
his whole thing is that he's dead, but not really. And I'm going to um, attack some random people because I did not time that jump correctly. Ow! He hit me. Yeah, but they can't really do shit, because I have the power of the Wraith, which means I can basically turn into a ghost. Elven Light! Yeah, that's a fire explosion thing. Oh, and I can collect an item, apparently. I did not notice that item there. Alright, well, I'm not here to fight with the small fries, am I right? We're hunting the big boys. Big like Sean, just how I like him. Okay. Okay, but everyone in the comment section before you start calling me and Sean a couple, no, we're just we're just joking around. We're not gay. Yes, he has a girlfriend and I am searching. He has his eyes on a lovely lady, ain't that right, Sean? Yes, I do. She's very Unique. Yes, and she's my best friend, and if he breaks her heart, I'm gonna fucking cut his throat out. Let's go! <laughs> yeah, that's probably gonna get me demonetized. I don't really care, though. You know, like, I could, I could play it safe and say normal things, but I could assert my opinion and let people know what I think. And also, you don't really have to play that as... Oh, look at this feller. This is the guy that we are hunting. Koth the Gambler. Huh, he reminds me of Tsunade from Naruto. How the fuck does he ri remind you of Tsunade? Because she was a gambler too. But he looks nothing like her. He doesn't even have her massive jugs. <laughs> okay, you got me there. Alright, so he is a slayer. That sounds scary. And he has a Karagor pack. Now, Sean, if you didn't know, in Shadow of War, Karagors are basically like wolves, but crazier. Okay. They're I don't think I've ever heard of that. They're basically like a larger wolf, and they get like way more hostile. Okay, okay. And the problem is, this man is vigilant against stealth, so I can't jump off of a rooftop and attack him and be able to damage him a lot, because he'll see me coming. I have no clue how the fuck he sees me coming, he just does somehow. Maybe he has a third eye. Maybe it's some dark magic. Dark magic, but he's not well, now, interesting fact, in the Lord of the Rings, they do reveal that orcs are actually born from elves. I wonder if the elves have mundane yeah, objects as we before. do. Yeah, I've heard that before. It seems very interesting, because if there's this, there's this movie with Will Smith, and they have orcs and yeah. elves, and they are completely different from each other. What but movie? they do come from elves. What movie are you talking about with Will Smith? I don't think I've ever heard of that movie. It's a movie called Right. Oh shit, never mind, I have heard of that. I've seen it on Netflix before. Yeah, it's a, it's a really good movie, and to all of you viewers, I suggest you watch it. It's a really good movie, and I love it. I love it. Yeah. One thing that pissed me off is when I, I saw a review for it that said it was a bad movie, actually. I mean, I, I understand why they were saying that. There was, Ooh, there was fuck! You, did, you didn't see that? I took the dude's head off. A game of chunks. Now it's time to fight. Now it's time to fight Koth the Gambler. Only way to see what comes up is to play the game. So I mean, he's okay. Let me. Oh. What the fuck? I have no clue what the hell that is. I I do not remember attacking that thing. I'll vomit this Hold on a sec, let's check, let's check this real quick. World, upon you, upon yeah, I get it, shut the fuck up so I can see what your deal is. Yo, what the fuck happened to his mouth? <laughs> Look at this shit. Oh my god, it's like ripped off. I don't remember fighting this dude. 
But he has that burn mark on his face, which means I shamed him before. Oh. I don't remember fighting this dude. Alright. Maybe, maybe you did fight him in the past. Let's see how fucking overpowered he is. Let's see. He's immune to curse, immune to ice, immune to beast attacks. He's immune to... He's enraged by caragors and poison. Hmm. He's a fucking tank, apparently. Look at that description. He's a poisonous, feral tank. Oh, wow. That's kind of scary, not gonna lie. Yeah, and then his dis you Don't forget to talk up a little bit. Right, sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah. He, here are his class traits. He's an advanced class. He has determination. He can fucking heal himself. Oh, wow. Yeah, give me a sec. I'm gonna move the camera a little closer. Maybe that'll help it hear us more. Just a little. Yeah, good idea. Just a little bit closer. Just a little bit closer. And it's gonna suck if it's too loud, because then we're gonna have to reshoot this whole video. Oh my god, I definitely do not want to do that. No, yeah, I think you can talk like at medium volume now, because the camera's way closer. Okay, sounds good. All right. Oh, one of his class bonuses. Huh? Sean, what's going on? Um. Technical difficulties. I just uh, mute yourself for a couple minutes until they. Yeah, just unmute yourself when they get back. Sorry about that, folks. Sean was having technical difficulties. Somebody walked in while we were recording, but yeah. Let me keep looking at this. Jeez, this dude, this dude's gonna be tough. And he's vulnerable to stealth. That That's not good. That's not good at all. He's dazed by... Oh, never mind. That's good for me. That's, that's very good for me. And he's damaged by executions. Why only executions, though? Alright, um, let's get out of here, because he's trying to kill me. Yo, Sean, unmute yourself, bro. having some technical difficulties right now. What happened? Um, our video has been hijacked. What? Our video has been hijacked. What are you talking about, Sean? Uh, Sean, you can quit. How we oh. Well, just tell me that there was someone in the garage, bro. You don't have to talk in code. Oh. My bad. And plus, you can go back in your room if you need to. I mean, the camera's closer now. You don't have to talk that loud. Okay. Yeah, don't worry, Sean. We'll edit this part out. Yeah, good idea. Yeah, so apparently we're screwed. Let me what are you talking about? Okay, so apparently I'm screwed because... Um, so this guy, the guy that we were originally hunting, he has a Karagor. Okay. But that guy, the one with the messed up face, he ran in, I read his stats... He is apparently enraged by Karagors. Interesting. Which means when he sees them, he becomes more violent, but he hasn't become more violent yet, so I think we'll be okay. Okay. Oh shit, dodge, dodge, dodge. And he's angry now. Oh no, don't do that. He's angry. 
Oh crap, I was gonna use Elven Light, but I couldn't do it. Boom! Everyone's on fire! He's running! Oh wow! He's running away! Run from me! Oh wait, uh, Sean, how does it look on your side? Is it clear? All right, good. Okay, well, I gotta run away like a pussy now because I got poisoned. Oh, wow. But now, thankfully, I have enough arrows that where I can just spam stealth attacks on them. Because this guy is apparently highly vulnerable to stealth. So what, he has like a canine nose? No, he gets hurt by stealth really easily. Oh. Okay, I'm aware game that Koth the Gambler escaped. I, I saw him running away like a pussy. Yeah, he running away. Alright, now I'm gonna run away again and get to a higher point. Because then I can jump on top of him and shank him in the back. And yeah, shank him. Knock down. Kick his ass. Oh, and then this little dipshit tried to fight me. Oh no. I need to find some way to heal. I'm almost all out of health. Huh. I need to find some arrows. I'll show you why I need more arrows in a second. Now we grab the arrows. I run around a little. And then there's this guy right here. Bam. Shadow dominate. Now he's on my side. And I got health. Oh wow. That's actually do another shadow dominate on my side now I got more health this guy's gonna try and fight me again ow he poisoned me now I'm probably screwed again oh no no okay I'm going to run and grab that archer that's shooting at us because that can give me more health get that archer no he's gonna shoot me again wait okay never mind I'm good and take him over all right, there we go. Now watch this shit. I'm gonna do a full ass flip and get him with another stealth kill. Oh. Oh wait. Now I need to check something that I didn't check before. Okay, what's that? I forgot to check if he had a blood brother, cause I honestly don't really need this guy. And if I and if I di and if I shame him, it's just gonna get rid of that good damage. And plus. He's vulnerable to health, arrows, he's flammable, and he's sickly. Oh, wow. So what would he be worth to me, really? Uh, I would say nothing. Exactly, exactly. And you get to watch me be absolutely brutal to this poor bastard that's done absolutely nothing to me. Oh, no, your camera, your camera turned off. It's all right. I'm just checking the text from my girl. Oh. Yeah, remember Ladies I Ladies and gentlemen, we have confirmation from JC about his girlfriend. Come on, man. You don't have to snitch me out. I was just checking I was just checking on what she sent because I was t reminding her that I had to go because we were in the middle of filming. Oh shit, he's going to hit me. All right, good. We got him. We got him. We're going to keep I'm gonna keep striking him like this. Bam, bam, boom. Oh, he blocked it. Jump over his ass. Bam, oh. And dodge. Bam, boom. Oh, oh, get him. Oh, crap. Uh, I don't have any execution points now. I gotta kill some uh, normal guys. Oh, yeah. Because I want to show you the sheer brutality of me. The, the biggest sociopath in this game. Uh, okay, okay. So I gotta cut down some of the weaklings first. Oh crap, he hit me, he hit me, he hit me. And he poisoned me too. The more I take damage, the more I lose execution points. Oh wow. Ow! Shit, he, po he poisoned me again, that little bastard. Yes, I am very good at this game. Thank you for noticing. <laughs> he adapted. What does that, mean? that means that he'll block my jump now. Oh wow. 
That's really good. That's really smart thinking. And he's also enraged by poison, I forgot that. Oh. Stealth attack. Okay, good, good, good. He's been taken down again. And I'm all out of arrows yet again. Oh, and I'm poisoned again. Oh god, he's gonna kill me. I can get out of this. I can get out of this. He's gonna humiliate me. Oh no. What a douchebag. And he walks away from me. <laughs> that means he's gonna get more powerful. Oh wow. Yeah, this, this I may be good at this game, but it, it, it this game has a fondness for kicking you in the ass. Yeah, I can see that. We're gonna go after this asshole and take his head off. <laughs> I sense a slight uncomfort uncomfort from my odd demeanor. What do you mean by that? Well, I mean, from how you chuckled about me wanting to decapitate this fellow, you sounded quite uncomfortable with it. Um, not uncomfortable, but it is interesting. <laughs> I, I just love watching their heads roll. <laughs> <laughs> is something the matter, friend? No, nothing's wrong. It's almost time. <laughs> yes, cut off their heads. Well, before I do that, I can show you some of the other brutal acts I have done to other armies that I operate. Okay, okay. I operate more than one army, and by that I mean my army controls everywhere. Oh, wow. Yes, we control here. We control here. We control down over here. We control okay. this little place right here. And I think we control here too. Yep, we control all over this place. Wow, now that is real conquering right there. Hell yes, it's real conquering. Now let me, let me go to this army and explain to you a little bit of who's all here. Okay. All right, let me show you who we got. We got Shaka the Timid. I'm thinking of probably killing him. Hmm. He doesn't exactly. It's pretty easy. Exactly. Next we have Flack the Carver. I might kill him too. He doesn't really have any use to me. He's a level thirty. Oh wow. We. Seems powerful though. We have o Ugber Beast Butcher. Okay, what level is he? He is a level 38. Decent, and I can make him more powerful. Huh, okay. Then we have Golm the Wretch. He is a level 43. Wow. Exactly. Then we have this feller, Zathra Lycehead. Lycehead? Lycehead, that's his name. Then we got Grisha the Defender. I killed him too. Okay. We got Ronk the Rogue. I need to get him to be more powerful too. He's only a level 28. Yeah, I definitely kill him. No, because he was one of my captains. Huh, and your captain is low level. But then this guy, he's an interesting fella. Gosh, Face Eater. Oh, okay, that's true. interesting. Yes, he literally has a mask on his face because he won't stop eating faces. <laughs> then we have my, um, then we have my personal bodyguard who has absolutely no weaknesses, Nazu the Tricky. No weaknesses. Absolutely no weaknesses. He has decoys too, which means he can create fake versions of himself, like the Shadow Clone Jutsu. Oh, okay, that's dope. Yeah, so he has no weaknesses, Shadow Clone Jutsu, and he's a legendary. Oh, a legendary Stasi. Okay. Exactly. Then we have this guy. He's useless, but I can't kill him because he is 
He is Nazu's blood brother. Dang. I wouldn't want to kill him. He seems powerful. Then we got Emug Slave Keepers, and you kind of already know why I killed him. Yeah. He's a slave. I, I, I know. Then we have Douche Deathbone. Okay. He sounds like he would be in a metal band. That's probably why I recruited him. Interesting. We have Boo Ball Metalbeard. He was one of the war chiefs. Okay. We have Two Horn the Ancient One. Hmm. Oh, we, wow. We have Horza the fi the Machine. I killed him. Yeah, I can tell. I can't remember why he was called the Machine, though. Oh, that's right, because I cut off his arm. Uh, I can't remember why I killed him. And then we got my my war chiefs. Now, war chiefs are the ones that guard the actual warlord, the warlord. Okay. And so here are the war chiefs that guard the warlord. We have Luga of the Spiders. What level is he? He is a level 31, and he is a poisonous mystic beast master. Okay. And he and some of his advantages. He is a poison. He has poison weapons. He has a Karagor pack. He rides a Karagor. He can instantly slay beasts. Okay, interesting. And he can summon spiders. Ooh. Which cool. which spiders in this game have a tendency to kick you in the ass. Oh. We have Ushak. Wow. We have Ushak the Plan Maker. He seems like a tactical advisor. Then we have our second most important one, Lorm the Trainer. He seems like a sensei. Then we have Crackhorn the Militant. He seems like a general. And then we have our mighty J war chief. Hoshgrish the Amputator. He seems like a medical. Yes, but look at his arm. I cut off his arm, and then he came back to life with that fucking thing. The claw! The claw, yeah. But yeah, that's my army here. I'm trying to remember what other army I had somewhere. Let me... There was one that had a really cool guy. Okay, who I... was it? Let me go to this one. I think it was this one. This one seems to have way more powerful people in uh, Gorgoroth. Why is that? I don't know. Because Gorgoroth was like one of the strongest areas I had to conquer when I was playing the game the first time. Oh, okay. And, ah, this is the one I was going to show you. Bulg Iron Skull. Look at this guy. Oh, wow. He is a level 42 poisonous marauder tracker. Oh, wow. And his, so he's like a bounty hunter. Yep, and his only problem is he is heavily damaged by arrows. <laughs> but yeah, I killed him. I killed him, and he came back with a metal head. Wow. Yep. Let's see. Who else do this one has the dumbest name I've ever heard. His name is Luga Dead Killer. Oh my god. That and then stupid. This one though, he's a weird one. Look at his fucking body. What is on his body? His name is Flog Maggot Nest. Oh my god. So he's literally got like maggots inside of him. Ew. Yeah. This one I found recently, though. This is Ookbook the Golden. Okay, okay. And literally, Why you that? all of his armor is golden. Oh, okay. This man is like that Mark is like that Minecraft player that has all the golden armor. Okay, okay. And I keep backing out of the wrong things. I am so stupid. I am so sorry for me being dumb in this game. It's okay. We all have those moments. Yeah. 
All right, so we got this one. I showed you this one. Oh, and this one you might recognize from the movies. The tower with Sauron's eye. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, the, in the game, this game ties in to the actual Lord of the Rings movies, including The Hobbit. Oh, wow. So if you want to experience the story of the Lord of the Rings in order, you gotta watch The Hobbit's movies first, then you gotta play Shadow of Mordor, then you gotta play Shadow of War, and then you gotta play, and then you gotta watch the Lord of the Rings movies, just to let anyone know. Okay, then. Because around the ending of this game, they reveal how Sauron became the Eye. Oh. Oh, wow. An okay, that's interesting. An interesting fact I discovered while I was playing. Did you know that Sauron actually used to be hot? Really? Yeah, he was a white-haired elf with yellow eyes, and he was drop-dead gorgeous. Oh, wow. That does sound gorgeous. To think, the big ass dude in fucking armor with a mace used to be hot. <laughs> That's funny. Before he went mad for some reason. Right. But then here, this is Nernan. I cannot. This is the first area that you start in in the game. Okay. And thankfully, this place is absolutely filled to the brim with powerful people. Okay. Because as you can see, I have nothing but powerful war chiefs. I will show you all of them. We have Scoth of the White Hand. White Hand. Interesting. We have Kuga Deathmonger. Okay. We have Ar I forgot how to pronounce his name, but he is Hammerfist. Wow. Now that guy is someone I would have on my team. But he is not an Uruk. Uruks are a type of orc. He is actually a troll called an Olog. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can see that. Then we have Muzu Bootlick. So you see why I had him on my team. He will very eagerly lick my boots. Weird. But the one problem is he can be killed instantly by stealth attacks and also be can, can be killed instantly when getting set on fire. Okay, it seems pretty useless. But then but then we have my final war chief, Rosh the Brilliant. Hmm. And he is an assassin. Wow. Yeah, I can tell. But then we have our warlord, obviously. Nuruk the Cursed. Oh, okay. He kind of looks like a demon. Yeah. Now I'm trying to remember who was my most pop. This guy is so sad. Look at his level. He's level 16. No, he looks so strong though. And I can't kill him because he's with because he's the blood brother of a powerful guy I have. Oh, actually, no, never mind. He's not that... Oh, no. Never mind. I can... I can kill both of these two. <laughs> you know, I that think we... Good. I think we have enough time to butcher some... Some weaklings. What do you think, Sean? I say go for it. Let's butcher some weaklings. Ah-ha-ha! ha 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 <laughs> Okay, calm it down. I can't help it. It's gonna be so fun. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now, where the fuck do I gotta go again? Okay, down here, down here. Damn it, I keep forgetting. Alright, now we fast travel. Would you like me to give you a walk around my base? Do we have time? We should have time. Okay, then. Sure. And the best part about this game, it isn't the amazing story, it isn't the awesome mechanics, the best part about it, downright in my opinion, you take absolutely no fall damage. Oh, really? You can get knocked off the top of the tallest building in this game, and you will not get hurt at all. Huh. Okay. Yep. Interesting. Okay, we are here, boys. Let's begin this journey. 
damn, 3,000 feet away? Fuck no, I'm not walking that far. <laughs> I'll teleport my fat ass over there. <laughs> oh? I got a new... Oh, online pit fights. Fuck that shit. We don't play online. Nope. Well, Sean plays online, but I really don't like online. Yeah, I play online, but I don't have that many good games. He has G he has GTA, Black Ops 2 for the 360. Yeah. And I can't remember what else you said you had. I have Mortal Kombat, Resident Evil 5, Attack on Titan, and everyone, and, and everyone, please do not make fun of him for playing Resident Evil 5. It was the only one he could find. And it was oh, actually the only one that I was accustomed to. I used to play that game when I was younger, and I just really liked it. All right, now get ready. We're going to a oh, never mind. He's not here. What the fuck? Then why am I? Oh, okay. He's over here. Yeah. I almost freaked out for nothing, my friend. You are completely useless in every way. I'm gonna have to ditch you. Okay. It looks like he could kill you with one finger. Well, he really couldn't. Now it's time for him to sh now it's time for us to shun him. Let's see what happens. Oh wow. Oh, he's going to turn deranged. <laughs> and now he ran away. Never to be heard Dang. from again. And now not only is he kicked out of my army, he is now brain dead. Wow. I know, talk about a life of suffering. Not only have you been kicked out of the most powerful army in the world, you are now brain dead. Uh, I'm brain dead. I'm brain dead. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh -huh. I better lick my foot. <laughs> By the way, we do not have anything against people with disabilities. That was a joke. Calm down. Yes. Yes, we do not not make fun of people with disabilities. We don't go that way. Sean himself is on the spectrum. I feel like I might be on the spectrum just a teeny tiny bit. Yes, sir. Mostly because when I get to work, I go like hyper-focused on that shit, and I just can't stop doing it. Kinda... I am the opposite. Think of me working like doing crack. It's slightly... It, it's slightly... It, it's slightly better for you, but at the same time, you know, it's not really good to it's over. Nice it's it's not good to overwork yourself, but at the same time, it's better to bust your ass than just sit on your ass and do crack. If that makes right. any sense. Oh, Sean, check it out! I got a dragon. I got a dragon. And that guy is dead. <laughs> He, oh, wow, that's cool. he was burned alive. Oh shit, I'm stuck. Okay, never mind, we're good. We're good. We're good. Good dragon. Good dragon. Good boy. <laughs> and now we gotta hop down or else um or else the guy that we were trying to kill will not come after me. Yeah, you gotta kill that last dude. Now we just wander around a little and wait for him to run up and attack me. Yeah, show your face. Ah, he hasn't showed up yet. When? They usually show up pretty quickly after you kill a blood brother. Maybe you knew how powerful you didn't want to mess with you. Yeah, good point. You know what, let's just target them anyway. Good idea. Ow, fuck, that hurt. No, my eyes are watering, damn it. Yeah, same. All because I picked out a scab. I think it's because we're both tired. No, I wouldn't get tired this early. True. 
What do you mean, Sean? You you pussyfooting out on me? What? No. So you're saying you're not tired? I'm not saying that at all. Okay, well then maybe you should drink some more Mountain Dew watermelons. <laughs> yeah, your reaction when you found out that that thing was that the watermelon Mountain Dew was the thing. Was how am I supposed layers. to help myself? You shouldn't have brought that up knowing damn well how much I like watermelon flavored things. <laughs> you, ass. you know what? Just for that, just for that, I'm gonna get you a whole bunch of watermelon. Okay, I like watermelon too. I like raw watermelon and I like watermelon flavored. I'm gonna get you a whole lot of watermelon flavored things and watermelon and um, more. No, do you know that yesterday I finally just I finally found out what the hell WAP stood for? <laughs> I found out about what that means. A little while ago, like probably a few months ago. Well, no, my problem is that I had no idea because I don't because I don't listen to Cardi B. I find her music really annoying. Yeah. And, I... Yeah. Like, I I enjoyed Megan The Stallion's part on that song. I I that's she's one of the few female rappers I listen to. Oh fuck! Here it comes. What? Now I know that you don't give two shrugs about. What the hell happened? Might as well kill you now, as I can't think of anything Oh shit. What? What happened? I think this is a guy that died fighting for me. Oh no. So that means. for revenge? Yep, and he has iron will. Oh no. No, no, no. Might as well kill him. Yeah, he might as well. Before he kills you. Kill the thing he's riding. Shooting him in the head. Oh fuck! Dodge. Get your stupid doggo blown up. And like I said before, we don't have anything against the doggos, even though Sean likes this, likes dogs more than me. Yeah, I love dogs. I have my very own pit bull. Yep, and I prefer cats. They're not as jumpy as okay. they're not as jumpy as dogs. That's mainly my reason. Yeah, that's true. But you're an active person. You have you like to have a jumpy dog. Yeah, and me, no. I prefer sitting on my ass and playing video games. I try to work out here and there, but not as much as I used to. Yeah, I gotta. Oh well, shit! He's immune to execution too. I physically can't execute him. So what do you do? Uh, absolutely no clue. I'll think of something. Seems like you're a pickle. Indeed I am, sir. Indeed I am. So you're pickle Rick now. I'm pickle Rick. I'm pickle Rick. And get his ass again. Oh shit, there's one of my soldiers. I don't know what I did to you, sir. I don't know why you're asking me. I've never met you in my life. Ah, strange danger! Stranger danger! God, it really pisses me off. I'm not gonna be able to hurt him. Yeah. Oh shit! He he followed me. You'll never That guy that had the fucked up face, he came to the to the area I was at. He's not supposed to be able to follow me. I guess found a way. I'm gonna use one of my executions on him. Well looks like I'm gonna have two heads rolling. They hate him. Oh fuck! Oh, there's my dragon. Good dragon. Good dragon. I might feed one of these guys to him if he, if he keeps being a good boy. Ooh, good. He's broken. Dragon, dragon, dragon! Help me! Help me! Help me! Help! I can't melt him. What the hell? He's broken. No, he's dead. Your dragon? He's gonna die if I don't save his ass. 
No, fuck, he's dead. Dang. Rest in peace, dragon. Rest in peace, my little Draco. I barely knew you. But I feel like I've known you my whole life. That was some deep shit, my dude. Thank you. You're welcome, bro. I really, I really appreciate your deep writing. Thank you. And I enjoy your Thank you. I have a very stylish way to think about things. He's oh shit, that was that. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh no! Help. There was some poison that went off. I was gonna trick that guy into running into the poison because he can be instantly killed by it. Oh, but he outthought you. Yeah, he outthought my ass. Damn thought. And I'm gonna tackle his ass. Tackle him like football. Absolutely, sir. I'm going to give you a God damn it, I got another one coming out of what? More than you gave my brain, Oh shit, mother. that was the brother of the one dude we just killed. God damn. We're having a four-way now. Oh no. Not a four-way. Yes, a four-way, sir. They all want to kill me. Well, you better do something about it kill that first. I'm gonna shank this dude until he dies. Shanky! Shanky, shanky! Oh, Sean, watch. I'm gonna execute him. Watch this. Wait for it. I'm an idiot. Is he only at one eye? I think so. But watch. Bam! Oh! Oh! Cleaved. It's like a jump, it's like a jump force, and uh, Mortal Kombat had a child. Ah, uh, kind of, I guess. Well, actually, uh, what's that one game? It's a, uh, I think it's a role-play game. I don't know, I'm gonna have to look it up later. Sean, we don't call a role- I was gonna say, we don't call a role-play game, we call it an RPG. Right, right, right. <laughs> you're funny. I'm being serious, that's what it's called. Oh, I thought you were making a gun reference. No, that's literally what they're called. Role-playing games in short is an RPG. Oh, okay. Shank, 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 shank. First rule of the prison yard, shank the biggest guy first. But what if you don't have a shank? Then what? Uh, stab him with your dick. Remember, kids. Remember, kids, when in peril in prison and you don't have a shank, stab him with your dick. And if you don't have one, then you are, then you have been secretly living a lie out the book. Now, 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 Sean, we don't discriminate against different genders. You're right, I'm sorry. My apologies. My apologies. Though, though, yeah, seriously, if you get in prison, um, do not shank anybody unless you have a reason to be shanking. And murdered. Yeah. Ooh! Do not do anything... Decapitated. That, we that sounds bad. Don't do it. Don't... Stay in school. Don't do drugs. Don't go to jail. What the hell? They keep attacking me. Is he anymore? Okay, I'll kill you. He he's he told me to free him from the pit, so I'll cut his head off. Free me from the pit known as life. Okay, cut your head off. Okay, emo kid, I see your problem here. You went to too many drama classes. Dang, I thought that was a secret, man. No, that was actually a good roast from him since he was being all emo and I was like, Oh, I see, you went to too many poetry slams yesterday. Oh, I thought you were talking to me. <laughs> no, I was talking to this guy because he was like, Yeah, freed me from the pit of life. And I was like, Okay, buddy, I see, you went to too many poetry slams yesterday. Oh, life is a trap. Well, I mean, he has the spiky hair like some emo kids have. 
Yeah, yeah. Alright, now we hit him one more time and we can execute his ass. And stab. And head off. Stab, head off. <laughs> this is so much fun. Heads will oh. roll. These heads are rolling. They ain't stopping. Alright, where's that fucker that was supposed to attack me like an hour ago? We'll find them in the next episode, right, Sean? Yes, we will. Alright, folks, this is the end of the episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. This is JXP Tabo and... Hey, YKD Main. Signing off. And now we're Bye. gonna... And now we're gonna go fuck. Yeah. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And, and, don't forget to turn on notifications and that, and that joke about us fucking was just a joke. Don't take that yeah, out of context. Yeah. Wink, wink. Yes, yes, wink wink, very much. Um okay, bye everyone. <laughs>